Hello everybody, this is Techno Paladin. Welcome back to Dyson Sphere Program. Oh, he hid that little thumbs up right at the good time. So we are continuing our Beta Signe series. We are trying to just do things to wrap well whatever research up we can and just try to automate more and more until the dark fog update comes out, at which point we will start a brand new fresh series. So we're kind of using this platform now to help us build new blueprints and other things to kind of help us with uh, what we're doing. So uh, one of the things I am going to do is we are going to create a deuterium uh, process here. So I'm going to set this up to local da da da. So yeah, so we're going to take this. I have a partial blueprint here for deuterium segment. Um, we're going to take this and it's all going that way. Uh, I think, let's see, I might have to flip one of these, but we'll, we'll worry about that in a minute. Let's just kind of do that. So we'll, we'll get it figured out. We'll flip this or f not flip it or whatever the the roads here I don't have a whole lot of these um, fusion plants on me so we're just gonna kinda drop down what we can so basically we're trying to get some more deuterium fuel rod supply because well we're using up a lot of it so uh, let's just see what we can get done and see is this a, I got more oh well I mean the blueprint still says I got more so I'm just gonna keep dropping some down here I didn't think I had that many but maybe I had more on me than I thought okay well let's just start with that right now and I keep wanting to hit the Q key because I've been playing some Factorio so let's just see so this is uh, one of these is out the center so let's uh, flip that path so we're gonna have that one come this way those two go that way yada 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 and let's just kind of do this I'm not gonna connect it right away I want to get my uh, proliferation on there and let's just do let's get that on there boom and boom and we can just kind of go do 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 and let's see I, I need to go ahead and uh, Escape, escape. Uh, let's go ahead and just bring in some blue goo. And remote demand. Sure, that should. Ooh. Okay, we might have to add some more blue goo. Uh, oh, well. No, we need to give it some. But we need to add some blue goo to our uh, list of things to go manufacture. So I knew we were gonna start running short because we only had the one, the one uh, plant. So uh, you know, you know what? I gotta flip this whole path, and then we can connect it up because I did that wrong. Okay. So let's uh, let's go ahead and bring this guy here. This is gonna be hydrogen. That's gonna be hydrogen. And we'll just deal with not having it proliferated for the moment. And click, click, click. And we got some deuterium production. Yay! So this should get us some more. And yep, yep. And that's a full stack. We good to go. Let's see, how's that look on the output? And we're getting full loads, so... I'll call that a win for now. That should help with this guy, which is going to help us get some extra. So we need that. Now, like I said, we need some more blue. Oh, it helps if I hit the right button. Ugh. Nope. Okay. Yep. I've been playing too much Factorio here lately. All right. Here we go. So for the blue goo... Uh, we need nanotubes, we need diamonds, and we need coal. And that is, let's see, diamond, we have the kimberlite, 
nanotubes we have spinniform and all the other good stuff so let me see I think I have some blueprints for this uh, let's do do I have some in here I do not have any there let's go back up let's come in here let's see what do I have here any prolifer I have green so I might want to go in and put a green one down, but that, that's not... Okay, I need to upgrade a few things. And I'm out of... Am I out? Out? I am out, out. Okay, so... Uh, this planet, I don't think I have a, a hub on. This is one of the planets in our home system. So I don't think I actually... I mean, you can see kind of our old... Our old mess with all the wind farms and all of this fun. Let's see, what is that used for fuel? This is a hydrogen fuel rod. So we don't even have stuff making that. So <laughs> that's awesome. But we have, well, it looks like we got some carbon nanotubes here. We got tons of hydrogen here. Uh, we even have some of this other stuff here. Wow. Okay. So, well, what do we... Let's take a look. Let's just uh, take a walk down memory lane. Let's see. That's making crystalline glass and... Well, these have nothing to mine. They're done. So that's why those have stopped. Those have all stopped. These have all stopped. Wow. Well, the titanium here is still going. That's that's pretty good. All right, let's see. What else do we have on this planet? Let's just come in here to do this view because it'll be a little easier this way. We have a lot of open space. That's what we have. So it looked like we were making the fuel rods here. So where, where is it? If that's the case. Uh, I don't see it. Oh no, it's local demand remote supply. But I wouldn't have done that. Well, maybe I, I probably did do that now that I think about it. Because I didn't understand back then. So let's see, what else do we have on this planet? Do we have coal? Well, we have a little bit of coal. So where's the... Let's do this. Let's go ahead and get us a planetary hub up here. Oh, nope. Delete, delete, delete. Oh, come on. Why didn't you delete? There, delete. Yes. Let's do this again. There we go. Okay, that's better. Now, let's give you some drones. Let's give you some drones. Okay, let's give you some drones. And we're going to set you to warpers. We'll just get you a little bit. Remote demand. And for now, we are going to bring in some supplies. So let's get us some, uh, some of these guys. Let's get us some of these guys. And then we'll get this stuff, get our party started here. Let's get us some power to this bad boy. Doop. Okay, so there we go. Power is had. All right, now. Cole, where are you, Mr. Cole? I want to get all the coal here. Alright, just that itty bitty little patch. Alright, let's come back over here. There you are. Let's get us one of our new awesome miners. We're gonna go bloop. 
and we are going to say now somebody told me that I can actually change the gathering speed I wasn't paying attention so this is we're gonna crank it up to 11 and we're gonna get this thing some power and this thing's probably gonna empty this uh, vein really quick but we're gonna use everything that we can of it so we're just gonna come back up here and let's see did I create a blueprint for well you know what I did create one for I created one for copper create one for graphite oh wait, these are supers let's come back here to the end game let's get this good ones going so we got what do we got here we got copper iron graphite I think graphite will work so let's grab this graphite and we're gonna plant this bad boy down but we're gonna change it from graphite uh, oh wait you know what I probably should have looked at the recipe again it's coal straight into that. Uh, yeah, I just screwed up. So let's just do this. Uh, auto save. You devil. So the main thing that I'm trying to get to is... Well, I want to get my purple manufacturing kind of all good and then come on why is it taking like multiple clicks to do this here lately okay uh, now escape all right let's try this again uh, so I don't have I have green like I said I have green but I think I just have yellow under here. Where's my yellow? I could have sworn I had one. Uh, maybe it's just under here. Oh yeah. Boy, this is probably just a basic one. But you know what? We can we can work with that. Let's uh drop that there. And we're gonna use the upgrade planner and just say upgrade. Now, one of the other options for me to uh, end this game is if we get to the point where my computer just can't keep up. Uh, because we are starting to get to the point where our frame rate and update rate are not able to keep up. So, that's not a good thing for us. Because it's going to get to the point where it just makes it unplayable. But we will continue as much as we can until we get there. Because that's half the fun. Seeing if we can't push the limit of our computer here. Okay, so there's yellow. So then I have a blueprint for green under here. We're just going to use that green one. Here, I'm just going to set it right here. And then I need to come out and again do the upgrade planner here. Just kind of let it do its thing. Right? And then let's see. What else do what are we short? Uh, let's grab. Oh, I should have plenty. Do, 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 do. There we go. Okay, so. Uh, do I have a blueprint for green? Or for blue? That's the question. That is the big question. Do I have blue? Did I save my blue? I don't think I saved the blue one. Okay, I don't see it there. No, not there. Do, 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 blue. Okay, no, I did not save the blue. Um, wait, did I already use up all those 
All right, let's just drop some of those in there. Okay, that should finish that up. And we got to get diamonds in. And then that should be good to go. We're going to set that all the way up. And let's come up to our top of the house. So we obviously need diamonds. Because they are our building's best friend. <laughs> Moat man. Alright, let's get that in. And then let's see. Blue needs carbon nanotubes and green. So we can just use this same blueprint for green to make blue. That's what I'm going to do. Oh wait, hey look. Wait, I'm blind. There's blue right there. Okay, well, I'd rather be blind than empty-handed. So let's just uh, drop this down. And then we're going to uh, make sure we have what we need here. Grab. No, no, no. Come on. Let's grab a couple. Do, 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 do. This is the beauty of blueprints right here. You can just set this all up. And I mean, technically, you could probably even set this all up as one blueprint and just have it drop all three structures down. Um, you could probably save off an entire planet as a blueprint, to be honest. Uh, so this guy here, and we do have carbon nanotubes here already, so that's going to take advantage of that. And that should get us some blue production. So then we can come back up here to the top of the house. And we're going to set this down to nothing so that way we don't we can clear it out and we're just going to take it all clear and set blue up for exports. Local demand remote supply. All right, so that should help us out there. Now, you keep seeing this blue the purple cube here pop up. And I know it's starting to get a little annoying. So what I think I'm going to do to try to help out here for a moment is I'm going to pause production. And then what we're going to do is we're going to fly out here to our... Oh, man, that's far away. Uh, we're going to fly out here to our research planet. And we are going to pop up. Up, 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 and away. And we're going to speed up a little bit. And then I'm going to hit the warp because that's out quite a bit here so we don't have to sit through it and warp away this will whoop, take just a few seconds there and we are in business okay once I get this stuff here I can speed up a little bit we got the battery power for it Let's see what you got planet yeah, I think part of what we were trying to do is get power. So if I remember correctly, we dropped a fusion plant. But it was having trouble getting deuterium. But it looks like it's good now. So we come over here. Yeah, there we go. That's better. So let's come down here to our research station. We should see our lab kind of starting to get caught up so since we paused all these white cubes are going to start piling up which is what we want let's see how is our purple cubes we're almost a full belt so what we can do here yellow is starting to lag behind too but because we have so much in stock it should it looks like it's fine but do I have more research? I have more research towers. Good, good. Let's uh, let's drop a few more matrix labs here for purple. And we're gonna drop a few more for yellow. And let's just see if we can't start getting this closer to a full stack. Let's just uh, so I'd rather have some. Uh, extra, extra just sitting here 
than not having full belts. Let's see if we can't get it there. Come on. It takes about, it'll take a few seconds to kind of get us a, an idea how we're doing. So the yellow cube takes a little bit. We have everything set to extra products. So it should give us what we need. So 9.4 per minute, but we have this full stack. I mean, it looks like it's starting to get caught up, but I might still be able to drop some more. So let's just drop some more on purple. Oh, look at that. Almost a full belt. All right, let's uh, top it off, and we'll just throw a few more here on yellow. All right, so this should start get letting us, hopefully, see that we're just getting a few gaps every now and then. Hopefully, we'll be able to start getting this full. So let's come down here and see how we're doing, because this is going to keep making white cubes. So that's going to take it a little bit to get caught up. That's full, that's full, so yeah, we have no surplus of purple cubes right now. So it's doing its thing, it's going to take it a bit. White cubes, so like I said, kind of what we're doing is just trying to let this get to a point where we have a bit of a buffer. So you can see here we have, and I can add more here to increase our research speed too. So we're starting to buffer up our yellow or white science here. So that's starting to buffer up. And let's just come back over here really quick. So we have all of these guys and uh, well, we got some purples sitting down here. So these guys, these little lonely boys. Uh, I got a few extra on the end. That's okay. But it looks as long as our antimatter is keeping up too. That's the the other big one, which it looks like it is. So that's good. And you can see we got lots and lots of science towers here. So this is uh, this is slowly getting there. It's gonna take it. It'll take it a little bit, I think. So we're just gonna let's just come in here and land. And while that's doing that, we are gonna take a look at some of our spheres. So let's see how we are doing. Doobie. Okay, this one here we are at 100% satisfaction. Um, it looks like it's using just about everything that we have coming out of it. So that's good. Um, and it looks like it's complete. Okay, Adhill, it is still building. Okay, we can see rocket launches, we can see solar sails. It's still got a long way to go. But uh, it looks like we have a lot of power that we can consume. So we can turn that into exotic matter like crazy. Uh, let's see, Altace. Uh, so this one, we have a lot of sails in orbit. Are we getting any rockets launched? Um, it doesn't look like it. So we might still be lacking in our rocket production. Um, it just depends on who, which solar systems are getting prioritized by the AI here. You know, because we have logistics, so we have all these systems that, I mean, you see this one doesn't even have anything being launched yet. Uh, so yeah, so here's solar sails being consumed. Uh, let's see, Superba. Yeah, so many, so many swarms I have set up, but not enough production. So this one here again, dang. Okay, so we need to look at our production. So obviously, the main thing, which is rockets, which we were working on in Ad Hill. So if we come over here, we should be able to go to Ad Hill. Uh, if I can 
see it here. Let's see, I think it's three, I think is our, yeah. And production, yeah, let's just come down here and see if we can find rockets and see how we're doing. It's like, when you get into this late game, this is your, this is what you gotta look at. So, uh, I don't see rockets, I don't see solar sails. Uh, okay, maybe it wasn't three, maybe is it four? Okay, minerals, graphite, glass, rings, quantum chips, solar sails. Okay, producing 1,200, consuming 500. Rockets, production, 125 per minute, consumption zero. Uh, did I fail to set up the export? That could be a possibility, but look, even here, this is under our consumption, so it could just be limiting how much we can get. So, well, once this stops ticking away, which will probably happen after this gets full, uh, we can crank, we'll t I'll turn back on my research. Um, oh, dang it, hold on. Come here, hit the right key. Uh, let's see, so how are we doing? So this is almost a full belt, but eh, dang it, it's still just not enough. It's almost like I need another stack of, a whole nother row of purple. But even our red's starting to get caught up there. So greens being consumed. All right, well, we're going to, we'll get there. All right, so the main thing I need to go look at is we need to go over here to Ed Hill and see how things are doing. So let's come back over here. View, so it's Ed Hill 4 is where we have the rocket production. So let's go there. And I don't think I have anything on Ed Hill 5 yet. So let's get out of here. Up, up. And away we go. And let's speed up as much as we can before we take off. As we get into the logistics fun of the end game here. So the other things that you can you can look at when you start getting in here to this end game is getting some of the achievements. Um, which I still have quite a few achievements that I can unlock, so we can take a look at that once we get back here, once my mouse uh, decides to not go cuckoo. It's like, we'll come in here and check on this, because we can add some, uh, potentially some of the solar usage here too, so we can consume some of the power from the Dyson Sphere. Because this planet was looking like it was kind of week and there we go 0.3 we'll bring it in here in just a sec and we'll see kind of where we're how we're doing boom okay so we do have the ray receivers set up they're in power mode so yeah okay now let's uh let us find and we're gonna do it in this view here as you can see, we got tons of stuff on this planet. Uh, let's see, I think it was going to be down this way somewhere. So, I mean, I see things moving, which is always good. Um, some of our <laughs> starter setups that we were messing with. Uh, oil is running. The solar sails are running. Here's our frame component. What's... Uh, so this is lacking in frame material. Okay. And that's what's hampering our rocket production. Again, well, once this auto saves complete, we'll take a look. So, yeah, this is, yeah, okay. So that's our big bottleneck is frame production. So where's our frame material? 
Uh, let's see. Are we making it here? Okay, here's a frame material plant. So what's uh, what's holding you up? Uh, carbon nanotubes, it looks like, maybe? So, let's see. Where's my nanotubes? Are we making nanotubes here? I think those would be chemical plants. So that's making the alloy. Graphene. Nanotubes. Okay, well, it's making nanotubes, but how are we doing supply-wise? Not enough graphene. Go figure. Okay, Mr. Graphene. I mean, I see you doing stuff. How are you doing? So this is made of fire ice. It's just we're consuming it as fast as we can make it. That's the problem. Okay. Uh, did I save a blueprint for that? Uh, let's see. Let's find out. Uh, nanotube. I did not, but we can go make one off of our blueprint that we got. Or off of our platform we have here. It's just, I don't know if we have enough power on this planet. I might have to add some more fusion generators. Uh, let's see, where are you? Is that, this is it right here. Okay. Because we got plenty of fire ice. And if we come back in here and look... We can see that the fire ice is fine. The hydrogen is being consumed. The graphene is being consumed. It's just we need more. As with everything that we have been doing in this playthrough, we need more. More. Must have more. So let's just see if we can't make more. Alright, we're going to have to... Slowly kind of creep over here. Do, 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 and go boom. End game graphene. Graphene, and then we're going to pick this guy here. Actually, you know, let's do. Recipes, because this is coming from Fire Ice. Save. And then we can say, use now. And let's just see if we can't plop another one down. Do we have room to plop another one down? Will it let me drop one here? It will, but I don't have enough materials. Let's see, do I have quantum... I do not. Okay, well, let's... Uh, where did it go? It's on that side of the planet. Let's fly over there so we can let it start being built. And while it's starting to build it, we are going to come in here and see if we can't get some goods. Uh, see, there's that. See, rockets are being produced shipped out so it's just not too many places let's see what can we clear is there anything we can clear oh here we go we got one one available wait yeah one available let's come in here let's just get some quantum remote demand boom all right that should get us more than enough, hopefully. What else do we need? We need a box. A box. We need sorters or inserters or whatever they need to be called. <laughs> 
All right, let's let that get down there so we can get proliferation added. Do, 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 do. Did that save it? It did. We need to give it some drones. Okay, let's go see if we got our goods here in our tower. Uh, not you. Oh, you're empty. You got other stuff. Let's see, what do you got here? And you're in. Good. All right. Okay, let's let this thing get built. And hopefully this will help with our problem. Oh, I gotta pull a tower out of inventory too. I'm starting to run low on those too. Now I could probably actually import some to augment from other places that have extra. So well, after we get this drop down, we'll do that as well, because we want to get those rockets really cranking out. So that way they can get, they can do their thing. Alright, so that's filling up and sucking them out. And, yep, yep, okay. So that's going to do its thing. Let's come back up here. Let's uh, see. We had a tower that was empty. Well, we have this here. Let's do this. And we'll just do remote demand and see what we get. So hopefully that will help us with our frames. This will start getting caught up here shortly. Because we need rockets. We need lots and lots of rockets. Alright, where are you, rockets? Let's see, if we find the solar sails, we'll find the rockets. Where where are you at? I think we were back over here. All these nice size builds doing their thing, which is awesome. So how are you doing? Eh, still needs the frame material, so let's let's see, how is our Mr. Frame material over here? It's a little far away, which doesn't help really. But it's got a thousand let's just see. Let's just crank this up. Crank that up, crank that up, and see if we can't get this thing finally moving. Come on, buddy, you can do it. Uh, let's, oops. Yeah, let's just do that. Let's crank up your power consumption. Keep you charged and running as fast as possible. And hopefully, get this thing going it's always there's always something that is at odds ah, gosh dang it there's always something that is that at odds with your production chain <laughs> at least with mine considering I don't keep track really of what we've produced um, and where but uh, you know that's kind of Kind of the way I roll. I just kind of build it as I need it. If I need more, I build more. Which is what we're doing here. So, let's see. Come on. You can do it. Let's see. How is our up top sourcing of material going? Not you. Not you. Was it you? You. You. Well, it's all, of course it's the last one I pick. Um, so we got 6,000. 
in transit, but it's maxed out again, so it's coming. So it is bringing it in pretty quick. Let's uh, let's give it some extra juice to keep it charged. And let's see. I'd like to see this number jump up and hopefully start to stabilize. Apparently, we got a lot of stuff using graphene on this planet. Because that is just not keeping it supplied. I mean, we're getting 520 at a time. It's like, geez. All right, let's uh, let's look at our production chart. Let's see if what we if we can see what we're doing here. So we're now producing more than we consume. That's good. Technically, I guess, based on this graph. Uh, we're kind of even on those, but we're... I mean, it's acting like we're starting to get there, but we're not quite there. Alright, so what does that tell us? It tells us we need more and more graphene, which means we need more fire ice and processes to turn hydrogen to deuterium and then probably into fuel rods or some other product. What are we? I mean, some of these were just we're maxed out, so uh, you know we probably don't need that full stack, but eh. All right, so this guy here is doing its thing. It's creating a ton of deuterium, so we're obviously using that up too. Using slightly more than we're consuming, or producing less than we consume. Uh, so where? I wish there was a way for us to see what's consuming it. That would that'd be a nice uh, graph here, because I don't remember what all consumes deuterium, um, and I don't know if I can see here. Well, the strange matter and the fuel rod, obviously. Am I making strange matter here? That's the question. Do, 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 do. So fuel rods producing 600, consuming 900. I mean, this number is slowly starting to increase, which is a good sign. Okay, so we're not doing strange materials, mostly all just the fuel rod, which is consuming our of our deuterium, which is good. We want things to be fully consumed as much as possible. Uh, let's see, let's come look at our supply. So wait, how come how can we have a full load of graphene? Almost a full load of graphene. Uh, local supply, yeah. Okay, so... Our frame material should have a ton of it then, right? Why is it so slow? See if we can't get some more drones on it. Uh, this is so weird. So we have we have plenty, but 
but it's like it's not getting there. Or at least we have plenty now, because like here, this guy's here. So that's a supply. Yeah, it's only taking like one drone at a time. That's weird. Wish there was a way to like set like a priority or something to where it uses more. Yeah, I don't know what I can do extra. That's weird. I'm so used to it just like filling up. Oh wait, this is carbon. Oh lord. Carbon nanotubes. I'm looking at the wrong freaking thing. Did I just did I just screw that up? Did I really? So this has got a full stack now, so this is making a ton, this should be making a ton of nanotubes now. These are all working, so... Okay... So I goofed. Um... I'm going to set this to this and just do remote supply here. So this, we have plenty. Um, I goofed, I goofed, I goofed. Uh, let's see, anything else I can kind of clear out of here? Uh, let's do that one. Let's do this. Remote demand. There we go. This this might this might work better. Cause we do have some planets that are just eating up the spiniform to make this. Cause I have that one planet that we had that was just millions and millions of spiniform that we sucked up. And that's all that's happening on that planet is pulling out spiniform. So let's see that I'm hoping that will take care of the mess I just created. <laughs> there we go. Now we're gonna hit now we should start cooking with some grease here, hopefully. There we go. See that starting to crank up. So now it's cranking up, going down, going down, going down. And let's see, that's it looks like so far it's keeping up kind of but we now at least have all of the stack of frame material producers running Doo -doo -doo -doo. and there comes the next stack Okay, this is looking a lot better now, at least from the supply perspective. So, but manufacturing wise, it's still kind of eh. Uh, we do have pro proliferation turned on, uh, but why is it not working? Um, oh, are we out? Well, that's not good. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is bringing some in. So yeah, we were we're running dry on proliferation. That's that's never good. All right, so that should resolve itself from that perspective as well. Okay, our carbon nanotubes are now working. Frames are being built at full capacity on this this was set up anyway. It's not the best setup, but it, it is a setup. <laughs> Which means that we should have all of these rockets. Look at all those rockets. They're just sitting idle. Because we can't keep up. 
Um, I wonder if I should try to import frame material because I think I have extra on some of our worlds too. Uh, let's see. What about this guy? Let's. Okay, that one's done. So let's go here. Let's do frame material. Do we have some? Looks like we have some. Maybe not a ton. But well, that should that should help too. And this is where, like, if you wanted to, you could potentially like set up a planet to just focus on one thing. Um, and man, that purple still it's still going. <laughs> I was hoping by having it paused for this long it would be good to go, but uh, I can probably, let's see, what's this one? Construction, warp speed, logistics, that's going to help us a lot. Vein utilization. Let's, I'm just going to go ahead and turn this back on. I was hoping that that would have gotten caught up by now, but looks like we might be stuck for a bit. And our frame rate's starting to drop again, so yay. <laughs> See, that's going to be 15 minutes. Jeez. Okay, so, well, it is what it is. Alright, let's see. So this is, yeah, that's building. Come on, Mr. Rockets. I just want to see, let's see, this guy here. Should be starting to get some frame material in here now. Wow. Has it not come into the top section yet? Oh, yeah, it hasn't got here yet. Alright, there we go. Alright, so let's come back here. Which means this should start getting filled up. And can we get full consumption? Well, we're halfway there. It's like almost. Almost. Right. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that looks like that should do it. So now that thing should start spitting out some some of these guys, which means that this guy should start slowly having more than just three or four of these run. I hope. Otherwise, I might have to rethink this again. Maybe set up some manufacturing just for these sphere components. Okay, well, we're getting there. Slowly but surely. And how are we doing? We got rockets flying at least here. We probably don't have a whole lot of them actually being shipped out yet. Or if we do, I don't know where they're going. So, yeah, it's loading up it's slowly. It's very, very slow. So, it is doing its thing, slowly but surely. So, either way... We have been working through some logistical fun, trying to get more rockets, and I think we need to go set up some more uh, of this principal production chain on some of our other planets here, so that way we can uh, start really cranking out these rockets, because I would like to be able to get some more Dyson Spheres running, uh, so that way we can just you know, crank up our power generation capacity. But I really need this guy here to be working at full capacity. And we just don't have these frame components. So we might need to set up, we're gonna try to set up maybe some of these, these three, four things in a higher capacity. Maybe that's what we'll tackle next time. We do have at least one more planet in this solar system that we can use. So we can get some more stuff done. So I think in this next episode, we are going to come out here to Adele 5 and see what we can't get running. Uh, we have a little bit of resources on it, but, you know, not a whole lot. 
we will get there. And like I said, our main goal is to just try to make this grow as much as we can uh, until Dark Fog comes out. So until then, uh, if you've enjoyed Dyson Sphere program, remember like, comment, subscribe if you can. I would appreciate it. And thanks for watching. So good night.